It's our honor to invite Mr. Narendran, CEO, Managing Director, the leader of Tata Steel, and the president of CII. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Mitra, Honorable Governor of West Bengal, Honorable Chief Minister of West Bengal, Excellencies on and off the dais, ladies and gentlemen. I'm honored to be a part of the Bengal Global Business Summit today, and this summit is undoubtedly an important landmark in the state's journey to rapidly industrializing itself. It's been a proud privilege for CII to work as a national partner to the summit and our engagements with various departments of the state during the past few months have been truly enriching. I thank you, Honorable Chief Minister, for giving CII this opportunity. Our working relationship with the senior officials of the state government, including the Chief Secretary, the Chairman WBIDC and WBIIDC, and several others, have been of the highest order, and we shall continue to work closely with all of them. CII has mobilized participation of a large cross-section of Indian industry today from across the country for the BGBS and has convened a special meeting of its National Council on this occasion. Besides key industry leaders, my colleagues from CII, the President-designate Sanjeev Bajaj and the Director-General Chandrajit Banerjee are also present on this momentous occasion. Honorable Chief Minister, CII is a 126-year-old organization that was born in West Bengal and started its operations in Kolkata in 1895 making West Bengal truly special to us. We continue to have a strong presence here in our, with our Eastern Region headquarters based out of Kolkata and operating from the same building where we started our journey. Today, CII is a vast organization with a network of 52 office, 62 offices in the country and eight offices abroad, as well as institutional partnerships with 394 counterpart organizations in 133 countries. We would be happy to leverage this network to deepen the engagement and footprint of businesses, both domestic and international, in the state of West Bengal. Ma'am, you've always said that by the virtue of its strategic location, Bengal is a gateway to Southeast Asia, and here again, CII's extensive reach and relationship with institutions and industry associations in this region can help catalyze mutually beneficial partnerships. Honorable Chief Minister, BGBS is an important milestone and we at CII shall follow through on discussions held and the commitments made during the course of these two days so that we can bring back to you successful outcomes in due course. I would like to end by also talking about our experience as Tata Steel. Tata Steel has been invested in the state for many, many decades. Our commercial headquarters is here. Tata Center is an iconic building on Chaurangi. We have manufacturing facilities in Haldia, in Karakpur, and we continue to grow. We are actually in the middle of an expansion in Karakpur. It's a 600 crore investment, and we are doubling our capacity there. And I must thank the government because it's been a wonderful experience for us, and we will continue to invest to grow in the state. The Tata Group also continues to have a strong presence in the state, with TCS having a very significant presence. In addition, of course, Indian hotels and the Taj Group of hotels are growing here, and of course, Tata Consumer Products has its uh, registered headquarters here. And in addition, there are many other Tata companies who operate in the state. And I think most importantly, we have a Tata Cancer Hospital, which is a world-class hospital which has been built in the state. And it's our privilege to be associated with the state and the city of Kolkata. So I wish the Bengal Global Business Summit a resounding success. Thank you very much for inviting us. Thank you. Thank you.